name is Lizzie Jamela Mutsimbabuleswa, Human Rights. I'm a human rights lawyer. And uh, today we're just talking about the issues of the legal age of consent in terms of uh, marriage regimes and uh, also taking into consideration the comments or statements that were made by the Prosecutor General in Zimbabwe. Uh, basically, for me, my observation is that uh, we don't have adequate laws that protect children. Our laws are not harmonized when it comes to issues that deal with children. We have some acts that talks about 12 years, issues that limit issues to, uh, to 16 years, uh, some laws that limit issues to 18. But for me, I think once we have a definition in terms of our children age that takes about 18, to say children are people below 18, everything should be harmonized to, to, to reflect 18. Because as it were now, the laws on the ground would permit a child to get married. It will permit even someone who is 12 years uh, to get married because the constitution does not necessarily, contrary to what maybe people might be thinking, uh, the constitution gives a right for someone who is 18 years to find a family, but it doesn't necessarily prohibit someone to get married before be, be below the age of 18, which means uh, someone who is below the age of 18 can actually get married by the blessings of the guardians, by the blessings of the parents who simply consent, and the child can actually get married. Uh, the constitution simply gives a right to someone who is 18 years old not to be uh, refused the right to marriage, not to be barred from getting married. They can exercise that right on themselves as a matter of right, not necessarily asking anyone to consent on their behalf. That's my understanding of the constitution of this. So the laws at the moment are not, insu are not are so insufficient to deal with the issue of the age of uh, consent. Because as far as I'm concerned, we don't have to talk about cons a consenting 12-year-old or a consenting 14-year-old. Because that is a child, it needs decisions being made by adults. And as far as I'm concerned, adults in Zimbabwe are 18 years and a half.